Hello guys, I hope you are all doing great. We are back. More information is starting to come together regarding Samsung's Galaxy Tab S10 series and both of the tablets, which are anticipated in October, will run on the Dimensity 9300 Plus chip rather than the conventional Snapdragon chip. Yes, both as it is said that the third model, the Galaxy Tab S10, will no longer be available. The Samsung Galaxy Tab S10 Ultra has now performed Geekbench with the 9300 Plus chip as we have previously seen with the Galaxy Tab S10 Plus. Have a look at the motherboard line with GTS 10U written. The 8-core CPU cluster only contains four big Cortex-X 4 cores, 3 at 2.85 GHz and one at 3.4 GHz, and four Cortex-A720 cores, 4 at 2.0 GHz. The GPU is an Immortalis G720, which Geekbench did not evaluate. Wi-Fi 7 and Bluetooth 5.4 are also supported by the Dimensity 9300+, and a 5G connection where the chip's 5G modem supports both sub of 6 GHz and millimeter wave will be an option for the tablet. The RAM, which is 12 GB and identical to that of the Tab S9 series, is the last noteworthy item in the Geekbench assessment. A 16 GB RAM version of the Ultra should be available, although it probably won't be available everywhere or in all memory combination. Although the Tab S10 slates are expected to appear later, the Dimensity 9300 Plus is expected to outperform the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 Samsung Galaxy chip, with the MediaTek chip likely less less expensive than the Qualcomm one, Samsung should benefit as well. In addition to that piece of news, since the Galaxy S22 series, Samsung has gradually discontinued the Samsung Messages software in the US and shipped Google Messages as the default RCS or SMS client on new smartphones. That will not be the case with the next Galaxy C Fold 6 and Flip 6 foldable, which it has been revealed will not be available in the US with the Samsung Messages app. According to a post from the Samsung Members app, Samsung's upcoming foldables will not come pre-installed with Samsung Messages instead, Google Messages will be the default SMS or RCS software. The Samsung Messages software is still available for download and use from the Galaxy Store. It is still anticipated that devices sold outside of the US will come preloaded with Samsung Messages. That said, I'll be ending the discussion for today. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below as well. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. The tech chat is over and I am out.